What's going on guys? So it's about two weeks into ladder and I figured I'd make a build video of my current gear and stats on my Zerker find item barbarian. So starting off with the stats, um, I put just enough into strength and dexterity in order to use my gear and then the rest into vitality. So pretty pretty standard there for a lot of builds actually. Um, my resistances are almost maxed. Um, I just didn't actually do Act 5 yet, so I didn't get the, uh, the resistance scroll. And um, yeah, so that's basically the stats. And then the advanced stats. I have all my gold, fear, gold find gear on, magic find gear. So 1,200 extra gold, almost 350% magic find. And... Um, 47% increase attack speed and 36% faster on walk, 35% faster hit recovery. And then the ignore target defense and minus 25 target defense comes from a grief, which is very helpful. Um, especially when my attack rating was low. Okay, so on to the gear. So we have grief here. And I'm going to switch to berserk, which is the main skill I use. And... I rolled really well. I made a video on it, 37, 395 out of the possible 4,400. So it has a bunch of awesome stats on it, including the damage. The main, the main key is the damage plus, because that's like a hidden value that's not shown on here. But it uh, definitely deals the damage to the enemies. The uh, damage to demons helps, because mainly I farm like Trav. And the Deadly Strike, obviously, and the Prevent Monster Heal should be good when I fight the uh, Diablo Clone, whenever he drops. Uh, area, it's face. So I'll probably get Shaco eventually for Magic Find, but I need the Resistances and Faster Hit Recovery. Uh, and the 2 to all skills and 2 to combat skills helps as well. Wealth, just for the uh, Magic Find and Gold Find. But eventually I want Enigma. This amulet I just rolled is pretty good for Gold Find. <laughs> Barbarian skill, Strength. Um, all resist and uh, gold find. Two isted uh, lem or two isted Alibaba for the uh, magic find. Plus, I get pretty good gold find with that. Chance guards, magic find, gold find, and I got two dwarf stars on for more gold find, and uh, my gold rat for obviously more gold find. Uh, I also have these boots just for resistances and faster on walk. I'll probably get war traps eventually. And then for the charms, I got my torch, I got an Annie, um, the first Diablo Cone drop. Um, some magic find, faster run walk, and char and resist charms, and then few and my Geeds, as well as a uh, few extra gold find charms there. Okay, so that's the gear, my Merc. I want Andes, but... I have Crown of Thieves, so when he gets a kill, he gets, uh, well, he has Life Stolen, as well as the, uh, extra gold, which is helpful. Uh, I have Stone for him, and I'll probably, yeah, I want to get Aralde Andes, and then, um, I gotta figure out what the best weapon is. Right now, I need the Insight, but maybe just an Insight in, uh, like a Cryptic Axe or something like that. But, uh, being that I use Berserk and I can't use Mana Steel, because Berserk doesn't, uh, Life or Mana Steel, I tend to use the, need the mana when I uh, get mana burned. Okay. So that's the gear. Stats. So basically one into each of these where it's, you see eight. And then um, I've been putting the remaining points into battle orders because it's a synergy of berserk. So more damage plus I get the, you know, the more, the more life. So does my mercenary. Uh, find potion, which is a synergy of find items. So you get one percent chance per level. So right now I'm um, at 64 percent Combat mastery is a max blade mastery for attack rating damage and critical strike one point into Increased speed increased stamina iron skin and resist all resist or natural resist One point into each of these to get berserk. So I max berserk and that's my main source of damage um, so goal, my goal right now is to get a, uh, an, an, an enigma so I can do runs more, more quickly with teleport. Plus it gives a 45% faster run walk when I'm running through town. Uh, 
So, I've just been trading a bunch of my items. I gambled a bunch of amulets, hoping for some more value. And uh, I'm just working my way towards uh, a jaw and burr rune. And they're coming down in price, so that, that's good as well. Okay, so that's the basic uh, setup. Let me just do a trav run just to show you guys what I've been doing and how much gold I get. <laughs> I want to do pit runs, but they're not as fast as uh, as the trav runs right now because I don't have teleport. And I'm online, so I can't save the map. Uh, I could always teleport or run from Outer Cloister, but it's not as quick as, as doing this. So I can't use Cannot Be Frozen on my Ravenfrost because the... Uh, when you find an item, you don't want to have them freeze and, and shatter because then you can't use find item on their corpse. But let's say I started off with I don't remember how many gold, how much gold, but you could see when they uh, wow, I'm not getting so piles of like thirty to fifty thousand gold. Pretty good. My mercenary actually does stay alive. I have to give him a rejuve here and there, but uh, for the most part, he's he's pretty good on his own. With Andy's with the attack speed, he should be much better. All right, so you see like 28,000, 40,000, uh, 40, 45,000. So I got 374 right now. And then I tend to sell like uh, any kind of, there's none here, but like uh, maybe masks, or uh, helms that give plus skills and wands and things like that that give uh, scarab shell boots or like will give you around probably 25 to 35 thousand gold and uh, yeah so that's that's the current build here and uh, I'll make another update video once I get my enigma but for now that's it thanks for watching and uh, let me know if you have any questions or comments below